Hey guys, it's Neat One Up here, and welcome back to Roblox Louie. Did I really just say Louie? <laughs> welcome back to Roblox Louie for idiots. So today we're gonna be talking about instances. So yeah, um, basically, what is an instance? It's basically just like, I guess the name of an instance is. Instances, they're kind of hard to explain. They're kind of not, but basically, um, man, how do I explain what an instance is? Okay, so this is an instance of a part. Like, it's, even if you change its name or its size, it's always going to be a part. It's never gonna not be a part. So yeah, um, that's kind of what an instance is. Like, you can see what like an instance is. Like this, for example, this is a script. This is the class name. The class name is like the string name of this instance most derived class. Yeah. That's what a class name is. You can't change its class name. It's always a script. It's always going to be a script. This is a part. It's always a part. It's always going to be a part. Even if you change its name or whatever, it's always going to be a part. So let's say we want to add a part to the workspace. So we do a local new part. We can name the variable whatever you want. Instance dot new and then the class name part and then you'd say like new part dot parent equals game dot workspace the parent is just like this is the parent the workspace like if I move this part to uh, replicated storage the parent is now replicated storage and the this script's parent is this part so yeah that's what a that's what a parent is so new part dot parent equals game dot workspace new part dot position is let's put it above the let's put it above the um the spawn location um zero ten zero and let's make this thing anchored so that it doesn't fall on top of the on top of the spawn location and let's run it and hopefully this works all right there it is there's the part oh they still use studs like this okay um i didn't actually think that okay um yeah that's what an instance is, and that's how to spawn an instance. Um, this is supposed to be the exact same as this, but, like, they added, um... They added those for some reason. Um, don't know why they added those, but, uh, yeah, that's how to spawn an instance. What if I were to spawn a wedge? How would I do that? How would I spawn? I guess, I don't know. Like, I would put it into replicated storage and I'd copy and paste that to here. I don't know, but whatever. That's, like, basically what an instance is and how to, um, how to spawn an instance. Wait, hold up one second, guys. Instance is the base class for all classes in the Roblox class hierarchy. Every other class that the Roblox engine defines inherits all of the numbers of instance. It is not possible to cr directly create instance objects. Instance has a special function called instance.new, which is used to create objects via code. This function takes the name of the class as a parameter and returns the created object. Abstract classes and services cannot be created with the instance.new function. Okay, so that's what an instance is. Oh, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching. If you like this video, please leave a like. If you didn't like this video, please leave a dislike. If you'd like to see the rest of the series, then please consider subscribing. I shall see you all in the next one. Till then, peace.